hi viewers welcome to my channel it's nice having you back today i'm going to be sharing with you on how to extract data from the profile this is a profile on the screen here we have we have the existing level the existing level you can see it is on what is on red and we have the design level so from these two data after the profile was successfully designed reports was generated you know the first thing is to work with your profile element and then what your cross section so with this you can generate your report you can generate your, your volume report for station can be generated the estimate cumulative cut and the, the cumulative cut volume and the cumulative fee volume can be generated for each of the station if you are here to watch this particular video i'm talking about and that is what that is how to what how to create network quantity you definitely found the video on my channel on how to create a network quantity from alignment profile and cross section from this particular data what i'm simply interested in today is to share with you on how to extract data from your profile you know in some cases when you are done designing your profile now you want to extract that particular data out so that you can use it for further analysis or for designing the road you can give it to an engineer and like it's quite easy and straightforward to do that all you simply need to do is to come to your two balls you click on two balls and under these two balls now we have three items on the list we have report manager we have subscription extension manager and miscellaneous all we simply need to do is to come to the report manager which is on blue you click on this plus icon that is beside it now on this plus icon you can know on my i've shared video on how to extract data on alignment recently so for those who don't know how to do that you can definitely watch that particular video but today is on profile so all i simply need to do is to click on this profile the plus icon beside the profile so i'll click on that and under this plus sign now we have drop down menu we have increment station elevation we have increment station knee we have profile design criteria we have profile in clsv and like so i'll start with the increment station elevation so i'm going to select the increment station elevation and i'll right click so i'll click on execute mind you for you to be able to get this done you have to have a you can see now it shows on the on the display menu you can see the list of design profiles you can see we have which this particular profile will save it we have to design we have the final road and we have first surface and you can see it the one on the on the red colors shows list of design profile and the one on green shows list of existing profile that is there was an existing profile and this existing profile is the one you can see that is on red here while the list of design profile the profile that was designed that is in such a way that the road has to be designed to have a level road and that is what i will i save with final road so with these two surface now with these two existing profile we can generate our report for it so for me to be able to do that you can see now we have the station as from the profile when you check the profile stations profile interval it was on 25 meter interval and on this place report setting station you can select the stations that you want to generate the report but adventure you don't want to generate the report for all the old data maybe you want to generate report from uh, changes starting from 0 to 1 kilometer or starting from 0 to 500 meters you can specify under the start stations and end stations and you can definitely also check in all these which says regular interval horizontal tangent point vertical tangent point alike so after that the next thing is for you to click on create report as soon as you click on create report it's going to show you yeah, creating report for you and the report will be created and this is the when you check this particular location you can see save to this is the default location where the report will be saved to on your system or your desktop so if you want to change the default location all you simply need to do is to click on these icons beside it here now you can see now the report has been generated we have the station you can see we have the eastern data the northeast and the elevation you can see this is the elevation existing and this is elevation design that is this was the initial elevation that was on the profile that was supplying for the profile and this was the elevation design that is the new road design the new level that you want the road to be and this is the elevation differences and this is the point type we have the start regular line curve and existing and that is how to extract your data for profile moreover you can also extract some other data like this 
place that says profile in CLV. When you click on profile in CLV, you click right click and you click on execute. Then you click on OK. As you can see now, this is the what this is the report for your profile which is which is on CLV. So this particular profile in CLV now you can see now we have the PVI stations. This is the column for the stations. We have the elevation, we have grade out, and we have the grading. Because this particular profile that was designed now, you can see we have it in sections. You can see it how to extract the profile in CSV and how to extract the whole information for your profile. The whole information starting from the eastern nothings, I the XYZ, the elevation for the new design and the old the old road. So with this little information, I believe you can definitely practice these particular videos on how to extract data from your profile. By the time you watch this particular video, you should be able to carry out that particular video. Let me give you a chest up because I believe it's something you'll be able to do. And if you found this video helpful, do want to subscribe to my channel, comment, like, and share. Thank you.